And welcome back to Moo. Um, took a while to get this video out because various reasons. One is I didn't play the game. Uh, the other is that Moo itself is kind of a little on the difficult side, but it's not because the area is difficult or the enemies hit for a ton of damage. It's because... Uh, various reasons. First is that this area is a bit on the long side. Sort of. And the other problem is that, as you can see, water. So we have multiple levels. So we can't immediately get to every enemy that is on screen. So we don't actually get our parameter increases as soon as we go from one screen to the next. We actually have to go all over the world and move, then have to remove the water, then go to the second layer there, defeat the monsters there, and then repeat the water stuff to get to the last ones, and then we get our parameters. So technically we are fighting a somewhat under level parametered, if you will, for the first major part of Mu. So, yeah, that's why Mu can be considered a bit on the difficult side. Not to mention the fact that this area, well, that Mu's um, enemies, bosses, are the vampires, which a lot of people consider pretty difficult. I personally cannot remember what was so difficult about them, but I'm sure I will remember when I encounter them. This guy is annoying. Not only does he teleport, he also throws a orb at us, which is a homing device, and it hurts. So we don't like that guy very much. Also, something I just recently figured out, I can block projectiles by doing the telekinesis pulley thing. Oh, Dude! Entice me with the treasure chest and then you pull that shit on me. Also, bubble. I will explain about it after I kill this guy. By the way, yes, technically you can hit him more than once but he tends to teleport away as soon as you hit him. But sometimes you can hit him twice. The bubble is actually just in our way right now. So there's no purpose right now. It will later on. This is what the bubble does. Boing! As I said, it will serve a purpose later. Right now, it's just there to be in our way. And another bubble in our way. Oops. I was confusing this one with these, who only need two hits to die. Also, these little buggers like jumping. Jumping away and in my way and everything. How dare you move to make your 
Stoner Froze actually hit. That's very rude. Also, you might notice I'm actually fighting somewhat defensively here, or at least trying to, because I only have one herb, and I know I can get some in the treasure chests here, and I'm trying to collect them and keep them for the vampire boss, because Oh, pretty. Uh, it missed me. Good. By the way, we might actually get to see the... All my HP has been taken away image, if you will, in this area. It's not really a um, game over, because since we collected the dark gems, we have multiple lives, so we don't actually die, we just get sent back to the beginning of the area. Uh, not beginning of the area, beginning of the screen of this area, so I don't have to go all the way back from the Seaside Palace entrance. Uh, enemies that I had already defeated at that point would uh, not respawn. Which is good. Oh shit, it's that guy. Coupled with that guy, not doing this. Uh, defeated enemies do not respawn. But if I die... While... Killing an enemy, ow. Then, yes, that enemy's HP would be healed. Okay. Ah, oh, again. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Technically, I'm not supposed to have gotten that yet. Well, yes, but not immediately upon entering the screen. But as you can see, a statue and another statue. And I just guesstimated here and pressed A and got the statue, which I do have to get. Because that. No, it doesn't mean anything. After all, it's a video game. They just design things to look pretty. Oh, I knew I forgot some enemies up here. Okay, so that's all of them from the top layer. How pretty!
I would say the ocean god is, uh, sun god is Ra, but maybe they mean a non-Egyptian way of it. Yes, we can! And... Uh, first thing I have to mention about this... Now that we have unlocked the second layer, if one of those teleporting guys is... the enemy, or an available enemy, at the... Uh, do not get hit by the slime. If one of the homing reapers ball thingies is the enemy here. He cannot teleport only to the second layer, he can also teleport up to the first layer, which can be annoying because it can be difficult to get him there. So, once again, a pretty annoying enemy. Good news though, up there is a dark space and I should have access to it now. You know, as soon as I get there. Yeah, that guy. Ow. Ugh. Think I can make it to the dark space without getting hit? One on me there. I say I'm not gonna make it. Wait. Uh, I thought that already showed a second one there. Wait, I remember this area. I remember this area being there as Friedan. I should be able to get to the dark space up there. Just have to move to the other side, I guess. That thingy there hurts. We don't want that. Another statue. Well, another statue we have to get. I could have sworn I could have gotten to the dark space there already. Huh. Okay. Oh! There's a thingy there. I have to try to remember that unless I can actually go there from a different area. Because we can use that when we get a new ability. God, they can throw diagonally too. Yeah, that's. He says stuff like that when he gets. Uh, knocked unconscious, let's call it that.
Sometimes he talks about imagining already being there. Oops. I ran too late. Or having fallen, stuff like that. By the way, we still don't get it. The parameter increased because there's another layer of water. No kidding. I wouldn't have guessed. But anyway, now I'm on... Now I am Fridan, and I have a longer range. That thing either hurts, and it kind of has an erratic pattern on where it goes for stretching, I guess. Haha, <laughs> you can't throw things at me because you can technically not see me. There. That's what the bouncy bubble does. Ugh. Thankfully, I have Friedan and his longer range now, so... there yet. I have to be well with an ability for that. You might think we can hit this with the Dark Fryer from afar? We can't. We have to run. Because I'm not sure why. It's kind of a silly thing to do. It's just a gimmick, I guess. There's no good reason why. Ooh, that was a big one. Haha, <laughs> your stones can hit me. Ow! They can! What the hell? Uh huh. Statue. Trying to run. I hate it that this game makes me hit the directional arrows twice to run. Just assign a button for it. Okay, psycho slider. Did I call it a psycho dash?
We. I'm actually gonna go all the way back just to see what that crack was in one of the earlier areas. I'm either gonna speed through that or cut it out if it wasn't important. And then I'm gonna see you back here, so... We'll see! It was nothing important. It was just a shortcut to another area that I've already been in. We I did it! Lots of enemies that way. I hate that thing. Aww. Nobody cares about your dreams, Will. Oh god, I have to push the bubble, bubble back in here. Ah! Uh, I thought I was gonna uh, gonna dodge that. I thought it wouldn't hit me because I was on a different pixel. Oh well, I'm almost done with all four of those, and then I don't have to fight the damn extendy thing as well. Also, as you can see, yeah, the Psycho Slider is kind of a 
stronger attack against them, against the golems. But, as you can also see, it's not that good because sometimes it doesn't hit. Because they have that invincibility part at them. Yay! I finally get a parameter increase! The statue was here-ish? I already forget where the statue appeared. There. There. Got it! It wasn't this direction, right? No. That direction leads to dead end water and the dark space. I think I went the wrong way... maybe... I hate Moo. I hate the design and the... where everything is. Everything looks the same! It's difficult to tell where I am.
Oh yeah, the shortcut I was mentioning. It's here. Not very helpful. At least I think so. Can I just give the statue to you? I know I saw the room earlier, and I was in it. I just can't remember where it was. But I said, everything looks the same! I'm sure it has an actual name, but I don't know it and I honestly don't care. I don't think it was here... or was it? This episode is going on too long anyway. I'm gonna find that room off screen. So I'll see you then.